There are continued woes for two of the Premier League's leading sides after both suffered surprise results in the fifth round of the FA Cup. Arsene Wenger's longest week in football continues after Arsenal were eliminated by Sunderland. Kieran Richardson put Martin O'Neill's side on their way just before the break. And an own goal from Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain added to Wenger's worries. Arsenal suffered a humiliating 4-0 Champions League defeat to Milan on Wednesday, with the defeat on Wearside all but making it seven years without silverware for them. The pressure also continues to increase on Andre Villas-Boas, as his Chelsea side were held to a one-all draw by Championship side Birmingham City. It could have been worse for the under-fire Portuguese manager as they fell behind to a close-range strike from Colin Murphy. Juan Mata saw a penalty saved moments later before a chorus of boos rang out around Stamford Bridge at half-time. Fernando Torres made it 20 games without scoring a goal, seeing himself substituted at the break before Daniel Sturridge spared the Blues' blushes midway through the second half. No, we're not good enough. Uh, for sure, it wasn't. But uh, we take uh, we take the game to St Andrews. A difficult game and another story because uh, at St Andrews, uh, Birmingham are undefeated in the league, and I'm sure that they they'll put on an even more decent challenge. Um, first half, uh, uh, with a lot of opportunities for us, better in the second half. But not enough to, to win the game. So never satisfying when you when you draw it uh, at home to a championship team. Well, I hope another uh, tough game. Uh, I, I hope so. It's um, let's say it gives us um, uh, extra games in already a, a tough season. But but whenever we've gone into a game, we've always gone into a game with with a, a real committed team, whatever the, the team has been. And uh, I nev I've never really been at a fault with players of lack of effort and, and endeavour. Uh, I still still would see, I think most people would still see as Chelsea the favourites to go through because that comes with Premier League status. Um, but I just hope that we can give them as good a game as what we did today. Elsewhere, Norwich City crashed out of the cup at the hands of Championship side Leicester City. Bolton put their relegation worries to one side as they eased into the quarterfinals with a 2-0 victory at Millwall whilst two early goals were enough to see Everton past Blackpool. Three potential upsets could follow today, with Stoke City facing a potentially tricky trip to League Two high flyers Crawley Town. Harry Redknapp expects his side will face a tough encounter when they travel to Stevenage, who only lost once in their last 13 matches at home, whilst Liverpool welcome 1983 FA Cup finalists Brighton and Hove Albion.